Hello there and welcome back to a, another episode. So, in this one, what we are gonna do is continue our housing complex over here. And it seems we have a new resource, vegetable oil, and we have resource uh, refrigerators as well. So I've kind of played around with the layout that I would like to have. So we, we got a bit of a starting setup done already, although they're not constructing it yet. So essentially how I want to do, I think I sort of want it to be like uh, matching on all sides in a way. So why don't we go through it? So in the corners, we're going to have two bedrooms on this side, on this corner, on this corner and on that corner. This here is going to be like the walkway or corridor. And same on this side. In the middle, we'll have a corridor that goes through like so. It just cuts straight through. So it's not completely identical to, to this side. But uh, yeah, so this room over here will be our storage and kitchen. I think against the wall, that's where we, where we are going to put the freezers, not the fridges. So we're completely going to skip the fridges, I think, and jump straight into freezers. And then uh, two cooking stations and again two freezers over here with a little door that directs them uh, directly into dining room which could be on this side and then a living room perhaps on this side and then on the other side i haven't put down the blueprint just yet but that's where we are going to have the crafting rooms as well okay so why don't we get started with this so first thing i think we'll do the to the rooms and maybe this side, so continue the construction, please. Yep, this will be fine, and probably the foundation here as well. Let's just mark it for construction again. We have uh, enough hay, so we should be fine. And now what we can do is we can continue our little fence over here as well. Well, actually, before we do that, we probably need to... If we take a look over here, so if this is going to be one of the rooms, we want it four wide. Okay, that should be fine. And then one more, just like so. So that should be our rooms and the rest of the space, I think will be fine to... Oh, that's a little bit lower, isn't it? Let's try this again. And press X to go up a level. Okay, I think we should be good now. So 610 is what we are lacking right now, but we'll be slowly increasing our stockpile. So yeah, the outer walls will be bricks for the insulation properties and the inner ones will actually be made out of uh, logs. Because that one has a slightly uh, yeah, medium thermal insulation. I'd prefer if it was an awful, but these walls wouldn't look so good so yeah we're gonna go with the wooden walls indoors instead now do we have where is it cloth is over there i think for the flooring let's go back a level okay soft carpets yeah that's probably what we want to have for bedrooms i think okay so that should be fine now we did construct a few new buildings as well so let's have a look what can we do you use grain but we do have tons of grain we have just completed our first harvest over here and uh, lara is already planting the next batch over there right sweet uh, syrup should we use that or grains oh good question maybe we do it with this one or now, because I believe that's what it's meant for, right? For cooking of sweet meals or in the production of sweet syrup and alcoholic beverages. Uh, okay, well, we do have a ton of grain as well. Let's do it this way, and moonshine we have. Oh, okay, fine. Great, and with you, we do have vegetable oil. Why don't we increase this to about 20 animal fats so for that raw insect meat and dun, dun, dun. right let's do that as well just a couple over here anything else we can do in here not really antibiotics and uh, maybe we should pickle a few maybe okay so we got some uh, rain finally what season is this wet season uh, it is a very short one but it's gonna boost the growth of our crops and the trees almost 60 percent already on average so that is not too bad at all yeah 550 left there's uh, still a few trees around that we can cut down but yeah i think we're pretty good to continue our 
walls as well. Okay, when it comes to the roofs, I think we are going to have to do three sets over here. And uh, although it's not going to look exciting, we are going to use, I think, bricks. I mean, carbon would be ideal, but do you know what? We can always replace it later. Yeah, I think it should be fine. Let's go back a level. Grab the bricks again. Ember, what are you doing here? One, two, three, four. I think that's where we need to go. Yep, this over here. And I do believe that's going to be the end of our housing estate. Now, when it comes to the crafting room, we may want to extend it out a little bit. So why don't we build the walls right about here for now. Okay, wood as well. So that's the inner. And let's do it once more through the middle as well. We have the fridges over here, but do we want to keep like the overall temperature pretty low as well? Because if we do, we could do like a internal... Wait, is that wood? It looks like sticks. No, it is wood. We could do it that we have like a door on this side and then a couple more doors on uh, either of these sides as well. Hmm, that's not gonna be perfect but uh, I think yeah for now until we figure this out we can leave it be and then yeah this uh, side of the room can now start from here but I do feel we want it slightly bigger because all the crafting researching tailoring and the storages as well it's just not gonna be enough happy days how are we doing over here probably have to place a door do we have a oh it's a doorway yikes so that's not gonna look so perfect i mean how about we change this up a little bit okay we haven't built any of them but i can't help myself it is bothering me a little bit let's remove yeah these sections okay so what this means we can place hmm let's do this one over here for now i know this corridor looks like uh it's it's pretty big but it's okay so first room goes here and second one one two three four so just like so all right it does mean we are gonna have to spend a little bit more concrete but i think we're we are okay with this no oh, yeah we're gonna have to reduce the size of this field by a little bit as well what are you? Plate grass. And you give us hay. Okay. Fine. We are gonna relocate you. I think over here for now. Yep. That should be fine. Although it might be a little bit too big. Who ran off? Oh, you're getting stones. Okay. Yeah, we got plenty in the storage right now. When it comes to the roof itself, I see stone is medium. This is better. Concrete integrity is a little bit lower, but that's fine. Yeah, I think we are going to go with the brick one. Concrete's going to look flat, but this one isn't. Yeah, it's three and three, which will be, will be better. So for that, we'll probably go through like so. Oh, overlapping. No, we don't want to overlap. I think that's the length we we want. And okay, we are gonna need. Let's place you here. Oh, toxic ash again. Oh dear. And then we probably want to bring you. Was it two over there? This way, this way. Yeah, I think that's big enough for for our purposes as well. Dining room living room and then maybe even this here as well maybe we don't need to extend it is what i'm thinking what we do need though is a bit of extra concrete we should also raise it a little bit okay yep that looks uh, pretty good now if we could cover up one of those sides now when it comes to the doors we may want to create an entrance like this Oh, wait a second. Then we would probably need to change it over into bricks as well. I think this will look a little bit better. Lovely. So first couple of rooms are ready. Let's have a look at the roofs. You are in, but not completed yet. Because we don't have bricks. Oh, of course. Yep. Let's continue our fencing around this area as well. So something like so will do for for now and actually this is where the kill zone is going to be we might even do it five wide three i feel is n hmm hang on a second one two three four 
Or maybe we do four. Because that's the way we can do the, uh, do the fences. Right? Oh, yeah. Okay. Never mind. I take it back. It is going to be perfect. So, remove those and uh, let's go back again. We do want to close off this corner here. Lovely. Old equipment. Right. I think it's going to be time to start making clothes very soon as well. It seems they are already starting to complain about it. And we'll probably need a few more plants over here if um right how many kill zones do we want to do do we want to do one on each corner or just on these sides i think we'll focus on left and right first and then we'll we'll see how we want to go about it in the future right i feel if this is the crafting area we probably want the cloth farm a little bit closer to us maybe maybe somewhere there people are getting sick already as well which is unfortunate but yeah, we're not too far. 324 bricks and 485 cement is what we what we still need. Construction level 2, we've got some pickles now. Security signal. Oh no, didn't get a chance to read it. Quinn, how are you? Oh, you're hungry. Of course. Go and eat. You are pretty well rested, I would say. How's your happiness now? It is going up. Let's have a look. You're just sitting, chilling out. I do want to send you on, uh, on an expedition though. Spaceship, debris, hmm, not as in interesting. Defense modules, ooh, shooting star, meteorite, okay, I think we are going to do this one. Quinn, off you go. Yeah, that moon or planet looks beautiful. I like how there's some like shooting stars as well. Another interesting thing I noticed in here is if you pause the game, like, you'll see that everything else around is still, like, moving, shooting stars, so it makes it feel like, oh, wait, wait a second, did I, did I pause the game or did I not? But with animals, oh no, you're paused, okay, so that's good. Yeah, just something interesting, here we go, game is paused, but we can still see that everything in space doesn't seem to, to stop, oh, no, we've just sent Quinn away with one of those weapons. How are we doing? You guys are pretty full and happy, so... Yep, duty calls, I'm afraid. It is getting light now as well, so that is... That is great. Oh no, these are slightly bigger insects. Wait, were you about to protect us? That was interesting. Oh, here they come. Oh no, don't spit on us. Die. Quick, get rid of him. Ah, okay, we've got our friendly over there. So let's uh, advance as well. Let's help him out. Do you knock him out? Oh no, you're pretty low on health. Animal attack. Two of them are coming. No, there's more now. Uh, should we pull back? No. I want you to deal with the big one. Miss. Okay, good. If you can get rid of the other big one as well, I'd be super happy. Almost. Alright, he's knocked out it seems. Let's go. Oh, here they come. Nope, run, run. Come on, guys. Uh, it would be good. Oh no. Come on, help me out. There we go. Okay, expedition completed. Um, some soldiers off their armor. I relieved some so Oh, okay. I also found a laser pistol that looks uh, to be in the working order. So that is... That is very good to hear. And we still have... Oh, wow. There's a lot of work ahead of us. Okay, who's over here? Here they come. Uh, that might be a few too many. Okay, let's uh, fall back a little bit. Ember, maybe you can shoot this guy here. Oh no, run. Too close. You run as well, there's more coming. Mm, 
Nice. Let's try and knock them out real quick and now it should be pretty easy. Nope. Get rid of him quick before he wakes up. Oh no, these guys as well. Okay, now we run. Ember, shoot this one. You guys run. Oh no, this is the explosive one, isn't it? Alright, we're, we're fine. We're okay. Okay, maybe you might want to start shooting. There's only six of them left. That should be a uh, five. What are you doing? Shoot already. Now you run. Okay, here we go. There's only one left. Oh wow, that's it. Beautiful. Well done everyone. Okay, it seems we can observe one of them. And then we'll just try and harvest as many, many as we can. Cool, so three times the speed again. Let's see how it goes. I think there was also another animal here that was pretty low on health. Oh, you're having a bit of a feast it seems. Yeah, we can still harvest the rest of them, so that's good. And it seems Quinn has returned to us as well. So we do have an extra weapon now. Your combat is three, it's zero. Why don't you grab a weapon for yourself? There we go. Right, so most of it is done. We have doors on the rooms as well. Well, they're not really doors. They're more like what you call them, like a doorway. So it's not going to offer a lot of protection if it gets cold. However, why is this one looking a little bit different? Is it because of the roofing? No, can't quite tell. But um, it's fine. Let's resume. Everything else seems to be okay. Right, there we go. And there are a few more walls we need to carry on with as well. Okay, oh, I see why it's different, because we haven't completed this link over here. Alright, let's do this as well. All connected up now. And we can do the same over here. Nope, do not do this one. There we go. And that's gonna go all the way till about here. Do we want to have like an inline on these doors as well? Maybe. It's a yes. Oh, that was a bit too far. Oh well. That's a 3, 5, come back, go this, nope, cancel, here we go, and these ones are a little too far it seems. So Quinn is almost done with the research as well, so that is Fabricator Matrixes, that is good to see. Our kitchen area is almost complete as well, I think it calls for a few upgrades. Well, first of all, why don't we place a few fences. We do need to access this area over here and it would be nice to have a shortcut in here as well. Okay then uh, fencing let's have a look. There is one over here which is fine. I think another thing we do want to start doing is a bit more fuel. Oh wow there's quite a few things here actually. We've got all these items. Yeah let's do fuel until we have like I want to keep at least 40 or no 60 so that's two trips worth of fuel and the next thing we probably want to do is let's see ah oh, let's give you one of uh, one of these ones as well what is next veggie letter oh yeah let's use some um, skin bark make like 30 okay insufficient materials 364 bricks but that is easier to produce Okay, construction level 6, fantastic. Lara is unarmed. Uh, yeah, we don't have another weapon just yet for you, I'm afraid. I think with the logs that we have right now, I would like to continue the defensive wall or perimeter that we have here. I think, yeah, fill here should be fine. It's not gonna defend us a lot, but yeah. Again, we just wanna funnel all the bugs if they do catch us off guard we wanna create like a couple little kill zones essentially 80% 87% on the on the palm trees over here so that's all good and this one shouldn't be too far behind either yep I bet some of those trees are 
58%, so that's not bad. Uh, which bits do we want to do? We've got loads of stone and synthetics, no. But skin bark is probably a good material to use. Okay, let's do one here and one like so. Tea boiling, lovely. Okay, actually, yeah, let's do some hot drinks. I don't think we had coffee over here. We have tea. Until let's do five. And that should be enough. Emeline reached cooking seven. Uh, a couple of people are starting to have meltdowns as well. So it's very dark. Disturb sleep, which we'll try and fix up in a second. Uh, a few fun things to do. Right, let's have a look at the leisure. Fine. Let's give you one of these things. A little punching bag for you guys. Help you relieve stress. Oh, no. What is that thing? That is massive large horned insect okay at least you're pretty close to us so that is that is good let's have a look right so you can maybe start uh, picking them off one by one happiness is low no i want you to just carry on with cooking you're not very happy either but your wrist is fine so i'm sorry but you're gonna have to come with us you are hungry can you eat okay Quinn is eating so that's good right we'll start with the uh, few of you hopefully the big one isn't gonna run oh never mind run everybody Jesus you are already here mm hmm okay run oh no trees is our safe zone run Ken oh no okay that's good to know oh dear okay I think we might be fine he's knocked out we're damaging those trees oh yes we are Ken's weapon just hide over here Ken oh wow he's just okay Okay, we do need our defenses up like ASAP. This is this is scary stuff. The movement speed and I can only imagine the damage he'd be causing us as well if we if he got close to us. Maybe a bit of distance between you and this thing. Oh no, that's a miss. Ah, uh, he's alive again. How many left? Still about eight over there. And... Okay. Let's advance. Uh, wait a second. There is somebody here, right? Yep. Okay, bit further. Let's just make sure that there's nobody here. When I think you can... Go a bit further. There we go. Uh... Alright, I think we'll be fine over here. Try and hit this one. Okay, another one is out. How many left? Only two. Okay. Now this. One more. Okay, lovely. If you can take this one down, we'll be done very shortly. Speed it up as well. Here we go. What's the time? 8 o'clock. Fine. You're gonna have plenty of time to go and enjoy your meal after this. Oh, I think it's... Where's the last one? Oh, here it is. And that's done. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So, we've got one of those bedrooms done. I think... We could assign this to... Who's the unhappiest? Maybe we give it to Emeline, because you're sort of stuck in indoors pretty much most of the time anyways and these roofs are almost done as well so that is good yeah we got quite a few furnaces running but it's still going a bit slow isn't it other than that the base seems to be going up pretty pretty nicely so far there's just a little bit left to do and if we do get a few extra logs as well then at least the walls will be or inner walls will be will be done very very quickly 92% of those, so maybe like one or two more days. And yeah, we've marked down a couple more trees over there as well, so 
things should be good. A bit more hay. What is this thing here? Cactus slime. At least with the foundation, we just need another 135 only. Quinn, what are you researching? Battery optimization. Okay, fair enough. That is quite a good thing to have. Once you're done, though, you could do freezers next. Yeah, that is something we do want to have. And it seems winter is arriving minus degrees already, which means some of our plants will not be growing for a short period of time. Oh, it's a cold snap. Eight degrees lower than usual. Okay, Ember, you... Don't seem to be a happy person. Crushingly unhappy, why? Why are you not getting anything fun? Let's have a quick look. Ember, what do you enjoy doing in life? Crafting. Okay, no indifference. So why don't we go into activities? Ember, let's take you off crafting. Let's make sure you're never to crafting. So maybe that will make you a little bit happier. She didn't particularly enjoy anything either. So you're on cooking, that's fine. Crafting and combat, yep. Nothing for Lara, Nova, and Quinn is research. So yeah, he's, he's on that right now. Let's have a look at some of our defenses as well. What is it that we can do here? Oh, traps. We are gonna want a lot of them around this area. I think we can still do like four. Yeah. What we also do want to do is uh, some flamethrowers around here, like so. Is it going to be the end of this year soon as well? Battery optimization is done. Next is the freezers. But you know what, Quinn? Why don't you observe? Let's get this done so we can uh, chop it up. All right, there you go. 50%. Yeah, it's going to be pretty, pretty quick for you. You can be chopped up as well. Okay, now butcher and... Oh wow, that's a lot of insect meat. Right, Juno, so taming... Oh, we could tame them. And we could do a statue as well. Fast runner. Oh yeah, and a very resilient. Definitely don't want to be seeing more of these guys. Although, when I read the, um, the patch notes... Not, not the patch notes, the update notes... There are a couple of new, stronger enemies as well. I think one was the purple scissor, scissor hand, and the other one I don't remember. But probably something pretty, pretty scary. Okay, so inner layers are looking surprisingly good, but for some reason there are different colors again. So what's going on over here? Now we... Oh, I see. We are missing a wall. What about this one? Uh, we Do we have an owner? I think Emmeline, you can jump in this bed. And then Ember in this one. I do want to get this one constructed. Ember. Uh, you're going to go and eat. Okay, Lara's there. Ken. Ken, how about you construct this? Oh, we're missing resources. Okay. Shooting star. So, Quinn. Okay, he's not doing too good. We do have fuel. Let's have a look. Shooting star. Oh, it's only three hours. When? I think you are ready for this mission. So, yep, yeah, let's send him over. See what we can get. Maybe some resources as well. And, well, you look at that. We have enough concrete now. Just five. Well, almost enough. Just five missing. So that should be quick. There's a couple of... Furnace is still powering through the night, so I believe in the morning we should be able to construct the last of the foundation there as well. Okay, so star-shaped formation. The crown here is black, smooth, and somewhat shiny. It forms a star-like shape with five identical tall rocks on each point. I feel an urgency to stand in between those rocks. I just know that something amazing will happen. Ah, <sighs> okay. Let's see what happens. Right, I stood at the center of the star and closed my eyes, and an overwhelming wave of relief and happiness came over me and washed away my fears, uncertainties, and petty thoughts. Words cannot fully describe this feeling. I will treasure it for the rest of my life. When it was over, I opened my eyes to find the five stones crumbled on the ground. Um, I hope you got some sort of resources as well. 
Although, I mean, if it's a plus 30 for the rest of life, then uh, I think we can be happy with this mission. Yeah, it should be good for the remainder of this playthrough, hopefully. Okay, there we go. So that's the final entrance. Oh, almost. That's the final entrance. Here we go. Research is all done now. Well, at least the things we care about, I think. Yeah, these ones are fine. Not a rush. And, um, okay. The house is coming along very, very nicely. Two more rooms are almost good to go as well. We are just gonna add some carpeting for, for these guys so they hopefully are not gonna cry too much about it. Uh, who's here? Nova. If you can. Oh. Okay, never mind. They are gonna finish this any any second now, so that's good. What we can also do is let's uh, connect up the last of the walls and that is pretty much everything now. Okay, so pretty fruitful episode. Our pathetic defensive wall is, is almost complete, but our majestic house is, is not too far from completion either, and once it's done, I, I think it's gonna be pretty good. Fairly efficient layout, I'm not sure if it's gonna have enough space, but what we can do in the future, if we need more sort of storage areas, we can always expand it uh, a little bit, maybe the corridors and maybe around like behind the bedrooms. Or, um, I mean, right now, since there's only six survivors, we could to w turn one of those sections into a storage room instead. But we'll see. I think for this episode, that should be, should be enough for us. And, uh, yeah, let's continue the construction and defending this colony in the next episode. So, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I look forward to seeing you again.